sovereign citizen, right? I don't know what that well, means. I, 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 there's no one that has control over me. I'm a free person right well, now. you may be a free no, person. No, I'm, I'm a free I'll person right now. For what and you're not free anymore. With all due respect, I'm a sovereign citizen, right? I don't know what that well, means. I, 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 there's, there's no one that has control over me. I'm a free person right well, now. Well, you may be a free no, person. No, I'm, I'm a free I'll person right now. For what and you're not free anymore. They're about to break my window, which I'm pressing charges about. I'm not leaving my vehicle. Glass is. Get all of it. They're about to break my window, which I'm pressing charges about. I'm not leaving my vehicle. Last year, get all of it. Earlier that day. Yes, sir. The reason I stopped you, your bike rack on the back, it's covering the license plate so it can't be red. Your center brake lights out. Okay, do you have your license restriction card, sir? No, I sure do. Okay. Just have to let you know we record video on all Yeah, I'm recording as well. For Volkswagen. Uh, you don't have your license with you? I sure don't. Okay. You have one in Maryland? No, I don't I don't have a license. You don't have one at all? No. Do you have any ID with you? Um ID is required for what's what's the emergency officer? Why am I being the the stop in general? I'm I'm confused, like this is a violation of the Maryland Transportation Act. That's why I said. Yeah, but that doesn't apply to me. I'm not a part of the Maryland Transportation Union. That doesn't apply to private citizens. That applies to people that's a part of the United States Constitution. That applies to people that's that's a part that has consent with the United States Constitution. I didn't sign. I'm not a part of that. Okay, well, you're driving a vehicle. I'm not driving a vehicle. This is an automobile. What in the doohickey is this Dave Chappelle lookalike sovereign talking about? An automobile and a vehicle is the same thing. Okay, we're a consumer good. Yeah. What is your last name, sir? Um, I don't answer questions about wh why do you need my name? What because it's required that I uh, document that I stopped you, sir. That's required, right. but you're not supposed to be stopping me by law because I haven't committed a crime. Right, you didn't commit a crime. You right. committed a violation. Of Violations the don't apply to private citizens. Crime does. No, sir, it does. No, 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 sir, it doesn't. Oh boy, he has a stack of Morris sovereign paperwork that nobody is interested in. Sir, please put the paperwork down. Nobody is reading your school book report. No, sir, it doesn't. I'm recording as well. Okay, that's You fine. took an oath for the Constitution, right? Sir, do you have an idea you took you, or you want me to supply me with your information? Why do I need to supply you? Because you're driving a vehicle, Am I under custodial arrest? You're not under arrest. So why do I even need to answer a question? You don't need to answer a question. Oh, so why are you I'm asking, asking me questions? What do you need my information for? Because I need to identify you. You don't need to identify you. me if I haven't committed a crime. Okay. Well, here's the issue. It's no issue. You're making an issue okay. right you now. You can either supply me with your information oh. so I can identify you or else you're going to be arrested. Arrested under what grounds? Because I don't know what, who you are. What you're crime arrested. have I committed? Right now, you're breaking the Constitution. You're going to arrest me and you have no crime. Who said that I committed something? Who was damaged? Where's the damaged party? You have to point them out. That's a crime. I'm sitting here with paperwork now, and you're still going to stay here thinking that you're an authority. You're not. We're recorded for all our safety okay. right now. So what am I going to be arrested for? For not identifying yourself. I don't have to identify you're myself sorry. unless it's a crime. You're lying right now. You're it's not a crime. You're li I, do you know what a crime is by the United States Constitution? I never Constitution? said you committed a crime. I well, said that you committed so what, a violation. So what, you, you cannot have your property or your personal being touched if you did not commit a crime there has to be a crime again where's the crime which you do, you're, li you're lying under oath right now you're recorded i'm not did i just not tell you i'm not under transportation article do you want to do you want to sir just because you say you're not under transportation article doesn't make it true so stop it with the foolishness all you're doing is agitating this policy enforcer and you're going to make things worse on yourself. Please stop it.
you move your back. Yes you do no. not need information. Are you going to this is what you're going to get from me. This is it. If this not is sufficient, you're going to break. You you're going to break into my private property, and then you you're going to kidnap me, right? No, I'm not going to yeah, kidnap you. Check that out. I got plenty of it. Okay. Check it out. So this Dave Chappelle lookalike just handed the policy enforcer what it appears to be about a hundred pieces of paper. So Mr. Dave Chappelle lookalike, do you really expect for this policy enforcer to read your school book report on the side of the road? Girl, bye. Read that Is officer. Your information in here, sir. You don't need my information. You're redundant right now. You're not getting any information from me because you don't deserve to have it. If it's not a crime, you're not even supposed to stop me. Do you know that, officer? Without a crime, you can't stop. It's 100 percent true. You, can I see a photo ID of you? I need your photo ID. Sure, you show me your photo ID. No, you're a public servant. That's what you are. I'm not. I'm a private citizen right, on the land. Right operating a motor vehicle. You are lying right now. Okay. Right now, you're I'll just a regular person. Okay, sit tight. I'll be Part up. two. I'm pulled over. Part two. Hey, buddy. What flavor chapstick is that? Driving without a license. Driving without a license. Got pulled over by the police. The first officer just called his back up and I'm quite sure he never heard about any of this before, so he had to go get a supervisor. This sovereign is so arrogant that he can't even foresee that he's clearly about to go to jail. <laughs> Yes. Are you going to give me your information? Or I'm not giving anything. Am I under arrest for anything? You will be unless you identify I yourself. will be under arrest for what? Under what grounds? What's the emergency? I didn't say there was an emergency. Well, if, if there's no emergency, what is the arrest for? Like, what's happening? What's going to happen right now is going to be bad. It's going to end bad because we're all recorded right now. And what you're trying to do is assume authority that you don't have. What I'm, I'm being very lawful right now. I'm, I'm, I'm within the law. And what you're trying to do, it's not going to work out. I'm trying to help you out right now. Right. You're assuming that you have I'm an authority. You no, no, you're you not. Because I have. No, you're not. Because I haven't committed a crime. Right. Do you, you understand? Have crime, I haven't committed a crime. You're not even supposed to be talking to me. I'm a free man in transit right now. You stop me for no reason. You need to know what civil codes are and what crime is. I'm talking to you like a calm man. We're being recorded. You right. got us flanked right now by your partner. You are so out of line right now. You can't even come in my car. This is a private vehicle. You have to ask me out of it. If you come in here and do anything, you just trespass. Are you going to exit the vehicle? I'm not exiting the vehicle. Under what ground? Okay, sir. So you already took your first loss. You just agreed that this was a vehicle. But earlier in the video, you said that it wasn't a vehicle, that it was an automobile. Which one is it? You have no grounds. You're just going to try to bully them. You don't even understand right now because it's who you are. It's who y'all are as a people. You refuse to stand down. All I got to do is go about my business, but it's going to go somewhere else because you have to have an authority that you don't have. You're here to keep the law, and I'm within the law, and you refuse because your pride is messed with now because I know my, I'm holding it right here. You're refusing, and we're recorded. We're recorded. Yeah, but, but you're so in you're the wrong. Going, I, just I don't have any question. reason to give you anything. And if I'm under custodial arrest, I'm going to stop talking. Am I under custodial arrest right now? You're being detained right now. Well, I'm not talking right now. Okay. Are you going to exit the car? Uh-oh. The silent treatment. Things are clearly about to go left. Had around the back of the vehicle, playing like they have authority. They have no authority. It's no reason for me to be stopped. I repeated it. 
And it's a peaceful detest. Like, I'm telling you what the law is. I'm showing it. I'm not getting out of my vehicle. I have no reason to get out of my vehicle. Sir, but I thought it wasn't a vehicle. I thought it was an automobile. That is what you told the policy enforcer a little while ago. They can call the whole force here. I'm not getting out of my vehicle. And I'm going to drive away. Wait a minute. I thought you solvers don't drive. I thought you only travel. Or well, it's going to be problems civil rights wise. And I can use the money and it's not going to be against the police force. It's going to be against that personal officer. Now I need you to identify yourself because you haven't properly identified yourself. Now you just a man outside my car with a gun. We have to go to that because this I, I asked this officer for a photo ID to see what corporate or not even officer this person because you're only an officer if I committed a crime which is an emergency damage to somebody or their property it needs to be a witness charging me with whatever he's talking about wrong because he's an observer to some violations that clearly I'm not a part of I'm a free man and not not a part of this um, United States of America thing where you need a driver's license and capital letters, um, a birth certificate and not a live certificate of birth. Are you stupid or something? And a social security card, which is something that only like federal agents are supposed to have. What? Bro, what are you talking about, man? So, I'm gonna sit tight and see what happens. You don't see what's in my head is bald as shit. Got some lumps on it. This is the part where they try to wait you out. Like the duress part. This is what will happen when like normal people that don't know the law, like you go to pieces while you waiting. They like, oh, we got something on you. They have nothing on you. If you haven't committed a crime, nobody pointed you out, said you did this to them, it's no crime. Wrong. This is the part where they pretend like they have the authority. But what you have to do is you still have to act peacefully. Like, they want me to act out. If I act out, then they have cause. I guess that falls under mayhem or, or public nuisance. That's why cops always say shit like, calm down. They're trying to promote a narrative like they're recording at your while. But as long as you talk in a conversational tone, don't get all expressive and shit, you're fine. They don't have the authority to pull you over. This is an illegal stop because no one said I committed a crime. He's coming off like, oh, you got a violation. I can't see your license plate. I don't even need a license plate on the car. That's what the law is, because I don't have to register it. It's a personal good, a household good. So What? Bro, what are you talking about, man? When you don't know that, they'll pull you over and give you all these tickets and shit. He's probably still going to write one, but I'm going to write UCC um, code 1207 without prejudice on it. Not consent, meaning I didn't sign up for any of that shit, so... That's what I'm going give, to give back to him. UCC 1207. Without prejudice. And you write on the ticket. And then you go have your day in court. And I'm charging him. It's been, what, 11 o'clock? What did I say my rate was? $100 an hour? pretty cheap I should charge more I should give myself a raise right here because it's raining outside on rainy days it costs more because of travel you know what I'm saying while I'm traveling and not driving my car you see there he goes with the contradictions now he says he's traveling and not driving his car but earlier he said the policy enforcer would give him a ticket and then he would drive off sir you don't even know what you're speaking of at this point. While I'm traveling and my consumer good to the place that I have to go inside to make my commerce, you know what I mean? Free man on the land, that kind of stuff. The funny thing here is this man really thinks he's schooling someone to how things should be done. He is so lost.
but he knows though like they they can't stand down that's the thing about it this is america on a whole and 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 when i talk about the construct when i'm talking about white versus caucasian this is what i'm talking about right now this is the white man and i'm like this is that no matter if you have the right or not like i don't give a fuck is what i say and this is the problem with this country in a whole these are the people that racism exists in while they look like all the other people this is police right this motherfucker right here he a regular citizen off the clock and what i'm talking about hold up for him too but since this is his job he gonna go hard with it and try to make here come the third cop now they gonna all get the same thing you're gonna get this not gonna change it's not nothing's gonna change you're gonna need the supervisor out here and it don't matter i already told them i already showed them this so they can try to take it all they want and actually i'm gonna give it to them this above all of their pay grade and shit. they trumping people like i got something in the car I'm lawful right now. Y'all y'all are the ones that's not lawful. Y'all talking about a legal system versus a lawful system. The Constitution is the law of the land. I'm an American nationalist. I'm not a goddamn citizen of some fake-ass Constitution. Not con Sir, what in the doohickey are you talking about? You are not a national. You were born here in the United States. If you're born here in the United States... You cannot be a national. Nationals are foreign born. Get it right. Institution, but the citizenship shit. Yeah, they come with their boss now. Da -da. Hello, officer. Yes, how are you? Are you are you failing to identify yourself right now? You have nothing with your name on it. It's it's really simpler than that. Yeah. There's no crime committed, so I'm wondering why I was pulled Sorry, over. I apologize, man. I legitimately can't hear you. But... There's no crime committed, so you guys shouldn't be pulling me over. Well, there's a traffic violation. I, I said crime. You're talking violation. I'm, the law of the land, the law of the letter versus the color of the letter, the law, all right? Like, you know what a violation is versus the law? With which what, what the police has jurisdiction over private citizens about is crime. Me hurting somebody at their property, right? That's what crime is. That's part of it. That's no, that's crime. That's what I, that's what I fall under. What you what you have a jurisdiction when I succumb to your orders is when I violate somebody's property right. or them. This is some civil nonsense. This is this is violations this in code. Is very minor. It's this is it's no, it's it's so minor that it's not a part of who I am because my motor vehicle, my v car is an automobile. It's not what you're talking about. I'm not a part of any of that that you're talking about. I explained this to your officers, but y'all still here. And, and you haven't identified yourself. Anybody got a, a photo ID? See, no, I already identified myself. No, no, you haven't. I need a photo ID because you work for a corporation. Okay. Otherwise, okay. otherwise, okay. I'm talking to a regular man right, right now. We do under what grounds? This is your final warning. Un under what grounds? Why, why are you arresting me? We don't want to do that. Listen, we listen. We're, we're not gonna play this game. You're, you're gonna have to break into my private property and then kidnap me. That's what you're gonna do. See, I would. No, that's what you're going to do. Go, you, if that's what you're going to do, we're not going to bargain that out because I know my rights. And you're going to come to court, not the police department, you, because that's what I'm going to file the suit against about violating my civil rights. Well, that, you absolutely have to well, okay, that, I, that is my right. Now, and here you are. Go, this could go one or two ways. Right now, I'm not talking anymore. Mm -hmm. I'm under custodial arrest. This is what I'm saying at this point. You're being detained right now. You don't need to be arrested. I mean, it, it's going to come to that if you fail to identify yourself, unfortunately. We don't want it to come to that. I'm quite sure you don't want it to come to that. So, if you have anything with your with your name on it, we can handle the traffic violation. We can all move on about our day. You see, this is what doesn't make sense about the sovereign citizens. The cop clearly just told him that all he needs to do is identify himself. They'll give him a citation, and then he'll go about his very way. But no, this sovereign wants to refuse to identify himself and is clearly just making things worse. This makes no sense. These sovereigns love to be wrong and strong. Are, are you not going to 
not going to do that, sir. Uh, what are y'all gonna read me my rights? Or am I gonna hold that against y'all too? No, 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 no. Because no. I'm under custodial arrest right now. I need to be Miranda. Y'all think it's a game. I'm not playing. All you had to do was read what I gave you, and I could have been on my way, but y'all want to violate my constitution, right? You, okay, sir. So you're not gonna supply any identification. So for what? For what need? It's a yes or no. What need? What crime was committed? Again. I've explained that. What crime? No, you haven't. Neither one of you have explained the crime. I'm using crime on purpose. You should know what's going on right now, but y'all still playing this role. I know exactly what's going okay, on. Okay, well, you're, you're gonna have you're gonna have to. What you're gonna have to do is come in my personal property and pull me out and kidnap me. That's what you're gonna have to do because right now you don't have any jurisdiction over me because I haven't committed a crime. And we can go through all of this, or it could be simple, and I could go about my way to the market like I was doing. That's what can happen. That's the only thing that's gonna happen. Or you two are gonna be cited for civil violations. I'm telling you. Okay. The VIN number is right there. Only thing you can check this car for is to see if it was stolen. That's it. That's what you have jurisdiction over. That. See if the car is stolen. Right, sir, I'm, exit the I'm not getting out of my personal vehicle. My personal consumer good. You're going to have to break in my personal vehicle and kidnap me. That's what's going to happen. Okay. Please don't make us break your vehicle. Listen. Go, do, no do, 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 hey, listen. Do what, do what y'all need to do. Do what you need to do. I'm not getting out of my personal view. Take it as far as you need to take it. Take, okay, I'm keeping my... You trying to violate my constitution and telling me I'm being silly? Right now you are under arrest. Please exit your vehicle. I'm not leaving anything. I'm not under arrest because I haven't committed a crime. I'm peaceably refusing to leave my personal property. I'm peaceably refusing to leave my personal property. That's what's happening. I'm not getting out of my personal property. Violate my constitution. And why are you touching my personal property? I'm asking these officers to, re well, these people to remove their hand from my personal property. That's what's happening right now. My personal property. So if you come in here, that's what you're facing, officer. And you guys don't even know the law. All right. Again, I'm going to ask you, please exit the vehicle. They're about to break my window, which I'm pressing charges about. I'm not leaving my vehicle. Glass shit. Get all of it. Three days later. I'm a sovereign citizen, right? I don't know what that well, means. I'm, 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 I mean, there's no one that has control over me. I'm a free person right well, now. you may be a free no, I'm person. A, no, I'm, I'm a free person. I'm right not For what you're not free anything. With all due respect, I'm a sovereign citizen, right? I don't know what that well, means. I'm, 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 I mean, there's no one that has control over me. I'm a free person right well, now. you may be a free person. No, I'm, no, I'm, I'm, I'm a free person. I'm not right For what you're not free anything. So this Morris sovereign clearly learned nothing from his encounter with the policy enforcers. After getting his window bashed, he's now trying the same sovereign nonsense in the court. And you know the judge is not having it. You interested in it, sir? No. What do you want to do? I can't tell the jurisdiction in the first place. What are you talking about? Challenging the jurisdiction the right to take it in the first place. I, I moved my constitutional rights when I came here this morning. What was that? The constitution. Is this a court of law? It is a court of law, yes. Well, I'm here under the law, the constitution. You're Mr. McFadden, McFadden, correct? Yeah, Mr. McFadden. That's me. Okay. Yes. So would you like a trial here today, sir? Um, I'm plead guilty. This, um, I came to see you. I can't plead if you don't have jurisdiction. With all due respect, I find as a matter of fact that the state of Maryland, the right. county of Baltimore, has jurisdiction over you. Um, Sorry, I made my point. We're not going to argue. I'm requesting a jury trial. Uh, well, you have a right to a jury trial. You have no right to a jury trial. You always have a right to a jury trial. I need to see that law, sir. Sir, I need, with all due respect, I need to see the law. Because we're in the court sir, I'm not sure. Law. Look, let me explain something to you. I don't show lawyers any law. They show me law. I'm not showing you any law. You show me law. 
with all due respect, I'm a sovereign citizen, right? I don't know what that means. Well, there's, there's no one that has control over me. I'm a free person right well, now. Well, you may be a free no, person. No, I'm, I'm a free person. I'll lock you right? up. But and you're not free anymore. And then it has to be a crime. It has to be intent, right? That's what I'm saying. Okay, I mean, there are some crimes, sir, that have mens rea attached to them. Mens rea is what? But did the mens rea is, is what? Well, can you explain the mens rea right? to me, please, sir? Because I'm an idiot. I don't know what the mens rea is. Can you explain that? You're a smart man. You explain mens rea to me, please. Okay, if these were cases that involved an intent crime, right? Right. 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 Exactly. These are non intent crimes. So this is a civil case. These are criminal cases. So where's the intent? Where's, where's the victim? That I mean, not every criminal case needs an intent, sir. So then, what's, what's, what am I being charged with? Why am well, I, I think you've been told a thousand times. So then, I need jurisdiction. There you go, Dave. A lawful order. One. Why was it a lawful order? Is what I'm saying. You want to try the case? You don't want to try the case. It's up to you. I don't want a jury trial. I do want to try by a jury. Sure. You're not entitled to a jury. I am. I'm a free man. I'm entitled to a jury trial. You're free all day long. But it's on the oath. Listen to me. You're not listening now. Are you by the oath, John? Am I? Are you under your oath to the Constitution today? Oh, absolutely. So you're under your oath. So we're a court of law. Let me explain this to you, sir. Unless it takes, unless there's 90 days. Unless it carries with it 90 days, the right to a jury trial. Listen, I wrote a motion. Listen, listen, you listen to me. I'm a, why, why am I listening? I'm a free man. That's what you do. You don't have authority over me as a free with man. With all due respect, I'm going to step back, John. All right, take him into custody. In the custody, my court. For what cost? Oh, I'm a man. free man. No, 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 no. Oh, oh. Look at this. What's the charges, John? You're disrupting my court, sir. This, this I offered you to take a plea you didn't want to. I offered you a trial you didn't want to. You haven't committed a trial. Now comes the part where we throw our heads back and laugh. Ready? Ready! Ready. <laughs> <laughs>